This summer if you are planning to visit historical heritages, we have a better option for you. You can simply take a trip to Hooghly and visit the Imambara to see the second largest watch in the world next only to Big Ben. Apart from that exquisite cut glass chandelier from Belgium, frescoes by Spanish artists make this place a worth visit. Tucked in a small suburban town in West Bengal, Hooghly Imambara is a great weekend destination for all art and history lovers. The Colonial Heritage Many of the suburban towns along the river Hooghly are old European settlements, dotted with colonial-style cottages, cemeteries and heritage buildings. These towns have an old-world charm that is irresistible to a city mouse. If you are fed up with the claustrophobic atmosphere of a metropolitan city then try out a tour in nearby Hooghly. You can pick one particular destination or take a leisurely trip down the river Hooghly visiting the Dutch, Portuguese and French colonial towns. Clock Tower Imambara The mosque and the madrasa are not the only attractions. The Gorigor or the clock tower is located opposite the main building. The sundial and the huge clock built by Black and Murray, London are magnificent to look at. If you can climb up 152 stairs to reach the top of the clock tower you will be amply rewarded by the view of three enormous iron bells and a room full of intricate machinery. It is fascinating to watch the technology. The magnificent view of the Imambara juxtaposed over a panoramic view of the river Ganga is simply from another world. Shea Imambara in Hooghly. One of the biggest attractions of the area is undoubtedly the huge Shea Imambara built by Haji Muhammad Morshin in the late 19th century. Imambara literally means the home of the Imams who are the severed heads of the Shia Muslims and also denotes the assembly hall for gathering during religious occasion like Muharram. The Hooghly Imambara consists of many attractive features including a mosque, a monument, and the clock tower. The mosque and the Sarai Khana or inns for weary travelers were built of Italian marble. The walls of the mosque are beautifully engraved with lines from the Holy Quran. Stepping foot inside the mosque one is struck by the pretty chandeliers made of delicate Belgian glass and stained glass windows that reflect the sunlight. The calligraphic inscriptions on the walls create an ambience of reverence. How to reach? You may take local train to Nahati Junction from Sialdeh Station, approx one hour journey. Then take another train from Nahati Junction, Nahati Bande local, and get off at Hooghly Ghat Station. 10 minutes journey. Imambara is situated just beside the Hooghly Ghat Station. Thanks for watching this video. 
This is a travel India presentation. If you like this video, please like and share.